Hi there, I'm Derek Shakespeare. Do you ever feel like you're living a double life, working hard at your day job and then drinking yourself into oblivion at night? You're sick and tired of driving past that bottle shop and feeling the need to drive in and stock up? Or perhaps you just want the anxiety, the withdrawals and the constant mind chatter about how soon to your next drink, you want that to stop. I get it. I'm a reformed alcoholic and I spent the better part of a decade addicted to booze to the point where it nearly killed me. Over the last 10 years, I've been on an incredible journey, including the good, the bad, the ugly, and the truly amazing. What I've discovered and unlocked for myself is the story and the tools that I'm going to share with you today and now. Six years ago, I was a mess. To the outside world, I wasn't the kind of guy who needed, to, who needed to drink heavily. I had a successful business, a beautiful home with my then wife, an amazing little toddler boy, and a thriving social life. But appearances are nothing. Behind the scenes, the wheels had completely fallen off this bus. The marriage and personal life were war zones. Business was actually chaos and I wasn't coping with the stress at all. Alcohol was the only way that I felt I could cope. In 2009, I hit absolute rock bottom and I had no way of actually getting out. An average day back then looked a little like this. I'd get up around 5 a.m. to a triple shot vodka and then coffee chasers. What a way to start the day. During a work day, I'd knock back around two large bottles of vodka and then at night, usually a bottle of red wine to finish it off and pass out, ready to do it all again the next day. I was a full functioning boozer. I was medicating my sanity away and using stealth-like tactics to hide it from the world. And I felt shame and fear, worried about the stigma of being called an alcoholic. So I kept those thoughts firmly at arm's length. This crazy binging lifestyle of secrets eventually caught up with me by way of a major health wake-up call. I finally ended up in an emergency hospital ward on life support with acute pancreatitis. I was told at the time I'd have around a 20% chance of, of survival, but somehow I dodged a bullet. And I remember the doctor saying to me just before I left hospital, if I drink again, it could be fatal. So I took his advice and I stopped drinking entirely. But I soon replaced the booze with other meds, tranquilizers. These were to numb the pain and to escape from reality. And this was in different ways. And you know what? This just kept happening. I had a lot of good stories to buy into as well. To justify it to myself, my divorce, the long legal battles, a permanent spinal injury, worry about money. So I always found myself back on the same troubled page. And as you can guess, drinking again. Oftentimes I would scream inside, you know, this is just not me. But I never dealt with the hard stuff, the triggers, and my fear, and my anxiety. So I spent many more years dipping in and out of sobriety, drinking in secret and deceiving my new amazing wife. I can tell you this, that it is totally normal. Hiding is where your disease loves to live and thrive. But I know you want to change, and here's the thing, when you're motivated to recover like I eventually was, there is hope. There are practical and actionable tools that do work. I know because I used them and I no longer battle with alcohol and cravings. So how did I get here? Well, I failed a hell of a lot of times before something just clicked. But I was relentless in my pursuit of sanity and finding a way out and finding a way out of this hot mess I was in. So what finally worked? It wasn't one specific thing. It was a systematic and collective approach of the emotional, the spiritual, and the physical transformations that created sustainable and a lasting bedrock for change. And now I want to share with you my complete system of how I kicked the booze bull to the curb and how you can too. So am I addicted today? You bet, to a life beyond booze. I've reconciled and made peace with the past You've got to do that. I'm openly free from alcohol, 
And believe it or not, I don't have cravings anymore. I'm fitter and healthier than I've, than I've been in 20 years. I have a deeper connection with my wife than ever. And I'm a, I'm a proud role model for my son. The roller coaster ride of disappointments and shameful consequences, well, they're gone. I get anxious at times for sure, but I have great tools and support that help me work through these things. So that's me, but more importantly, where are you today? Where do you want to be? To be honest, it doesn't matter whether you're drinking too much socially or you're drinking in secret or you've got a much more serious addiction. I'm here to tell you I get it and there is a way out. This is why I created Beyond Booze. It's my ultimate sobriety program to help you grab the booze bull by the horns with better, more effective ways of thinking and better healthy lifestyle choices. Let me help you overcome your reliance on alcohol and break that addiction so that you can start living your life again.